result, they're doing more damage, right? And what we have then is a much worse picture because how much damage could have been avoided, right? Um, but it's like the damage is piling up. The more they're running away from it, the more they're covering it, the more they're fixing, try not fixing it yet, the more they're not fixing it, and the more they're trying to go to extreme lengths just so that they look a certain way, right? Which is far from the truth. Um, the more damage there is. And it comes to the point when if they're faced with all that they did it's just like really bad it started with something not so big obviously right it started with something um some mistake or something let's say but because of their fear because they're choosing fear and not the right thing this small thing is growing into a huge problem. And these fools, they think that they're so smart. That's, that's the craziest part about it. And that's where the devil is again. But guess what? The world does not revolve around you. You're not God. <laughs> um, right? There is... There is God. We have God. And he is the one who decides everything. But. Yeah. So this is for those who have ears to hear and eyes to see. If you still have this understanding of what I'm trying to say. If you ignore this. It may be like the worst mistake of your, of your life. Because. It may turn you into those people who are lost cases, who are like in the point of no return. You know, I'm gonna say it as it is, okay? They are disgusting. It's disgusting to look at them. And then now you feel sorry for them, so on and so forth. Right? This life isn't easy, but it's also our choices. You know? My situation, if you know my situation, my situation is horrible, like, and yet, I'm thriving in this situation, right? But, if you understand what I'm saying, if there's something that you know you were wrong, you should accept it, you should see it for what it is, it's okay to make mistakes, everyone in the world made mistakes. And um, do your best to fix it, if there's anything that's fixable. And um, do your best the next time. See, it's up to us. Like Our actions also dictate how our life goes, how li our life unfolds. Um, so... That's why we have to choose the right thing every time. And what's the right thing to do is basically you have to talk to God. You have to know God, you have to know the word, and it's within you. Within you, you know what is right. It's not some like logic or something you were taught at school. Not always the right thing looks the right way. Sometimes the right thing looks like something crazy. But it's in a situation, because every situation is different. That crazy thing that looks crazy was the right thing to do and it can li literally save your life. There are situations like that. But if you are just scared and you shy away and you don't do that crazy thing, you may lose your life. That's how it is, and this is extreme, but some cases are so extreme. That's the reality.